Matthew Mitchell. Yes, Matthew. Okay. Katie. Hi, Katie. Nice to meet you. Yeah, I can't believe you guys are live. Oh, we're live on Zoom oh, and Facebook and a little bit of Cosmo Window. Cool, cool, cool. It's so nice to meet you, Katie and Matthew Mitchell. You call me Mitchell. I've got to change my no, name. No, no. I'm going to call you Matthew Mitchell, all right? Uh, thanks for coming. Yeah. Please take a moment home, drink, hot dogs. Can't wait to hear it. <laughs> yeah, thank you so much for coming. No problem. Yeah. Okay, I need to say hi to you. Hi. Killer wants to hang out on the stage with you. Huh? Killer wants to hang out with you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> really dumb.
Wait, what happens with the United Nations of the new women? It's called Facebook right now. Say hi. Hi. Dick here. <laughs> Wait, no. Oh, what's, hey. your, what's your real name? Oh, hey. Nice to see you there. <laughs> what's your real name? <laughs> Remember? Dusty Rose. Oh Lane. God, you are Dust Dusty Lane. <laughs> he looks so good with the whole everything. The palm tree. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> Is there a lot? Oh, in the it's in the concert window. Is he is, is he a pain? No. Okay. Anyone else say anything? We have about thirty people that are waiting. Hi, friends. Uh, this is Facebook and Periscope right up here. And then concert window. Hello. <laughs> I'll pick up. Hi friends, uh, I forgot which, this is concert window, so you see my hips, and I think you see me. Hi friends, we will be starting um, shortly, and yeah, thanks for tuning in. I hope, uh, Periscope, I can't see you, but I hope I'm getting some major heartage, because I need it, I need it. No hearts? There's no hearts. So I have someone looking for the hearts, and it's rude that, <laughs> that 
have four hearts. I have four hearts. I will take it. I will take those four hearts. Okay, that's like a hundred now. Yes! I love you guys! Keep them coming though, seriously. Like, don't be rude. This is killer. Who's rude too? Yeah. It's just staring, like, what's happening? What's going on? Oh, it's just like, some witcher is like, that I have to use next one, and he's going to stand there. Oh, it's on red. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I know that. Oh, yeah. 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 Oh,
like, oh, we, we work together, but I don't, I haven't seen him in two years. I don't know how to do that. I got that waiting. So then we're about to go in the room, and I'm like, one of my Hey guys, we're going to start in like five minutes. Yeah. So get a full drink and find a seat, guys. We're going to start in like five minutes. Thank you. Oh, right. 
아니면 혹시 의자 같은 거 있을까? Hey guys, thanks for coming to our little uh, show. Yeah. You guys are all good over there. Uh, we're gonna start now. Uh, this is our first ever uh, like live backyard party, uh, or backyard uh, event. So thanks for coming to make it a cool thing. Um, I'm gonna introduce uh, our opening act uh, first. He's gonna come out for a couple minutes, and then we'll get on with music. Again, thanks for coming. My wife and I are hosting the show, and we would love. We are happy that you came to our place. So thanks for coming out for the show. Uh, give it up for the very, very handsome, the very hilarious, and the half Mexican Mark Hurtado. <laughs> hey, thank you. Keep it going for Ryan, everybody. Yeah. yeah. Thanks, man. Woo. Isn't he great? April great. Fools. All right. <laughs> I had to get one in there. I'm a, I'm 100% Mexican, by the way. Uh, I, I get. Am I echoing right now? To you? Do you guys hear the echoing? I like it. Is it just me? Very little. Oh, you're good. I don't. I'll keep going. I'm just. I sound like I'm dead right now. Like I, I sound like I'm speaking to you from the grave right now. Just like, don't vote Trump, I'm from the future, you know. Um, this is interesting, a backyard show. I've, uh, I've never done a show where if, if a joke bombs, I actually might hear crickets. <laughs> but, all right. It's mixed results. I, I feel weird when, when you see that. You see it in cartoons, like someone tells like a shitty joke and you hear crickets. That's weird to me because it didn't make sense. Because from what I know, crickets, when they do that, it's because it's a mating thing. They're like trying to attract mates and stuff like that. So it's like even if the people don't like my jokes, like at least like the crickets want to fuck me. Which is, <laughs> that's my outdoor material. That's all I wrote for that. <laughs> this doesn't come out. I don't need it to come out. Okay. I like this though. That's cool. It's like a little. You can, like, have a drink right here or look at my penis. It's great. Sorry. Am I being too weird? I, I'm not going to do a lot of material, by the way, because I'm really excited about the, uh, the band. Um, no, no, no. You do you. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Lola. Um, I got called whitewashed the other day, and I didn't like it. I didn't like it one bit. 
and it's nothing against white people. It's nothing against you guys. Historically, you're crushing it. Like, I'm not, it's, it's, it's not, <laughs> I just didn't like it because I feel it was inaccurate. I didn't think, it, I don't think I act white. I think I act American. There's a big difference with that. I don't think it's the same thing. Like, to me, I don't even think most of you white people act white. I think most of you are cool. Like, in my head, like, white white is like a guy in a musical or something. It's like, to me, it's like an overseas thing. It's just like a top of the morning to you, but it's a cumberbatch. It's like, to me, like, that's like, like white in my head. I think you guys are cooler than that. It's always my ghetto friends who tell me this, too. My ghetto Hispanic friends. It's never like normal people who say that. It's always, like, I don't know if you guys have really ghetto friends, especially like ghetto Hispanic friends, like the really ghetto ones. Like, you know the ones who, like, they say the N-word too? <laughs> like that ghetto? Does anyone know what I'm talking about? It's terrible. You can't, you don't, you don't, you're like, all right, you, just, you wear it well, I guess. <laughs> I don't know what it means to be more Hispanic. What do they want me to sound like? They're like, you don't sound Hispanic. I don't know what that means to sound more Hispanic. Like, what, they want me to say more Hispanic stuff. I don't know what the, like, what is that? What is more Hispanic stuff? Like, the kitchen is haunted. Like, I don't know. I can't do an accent. <laughs> no, no. I like being Hispanic. I, I do love it. That's the thing. I love being Hispanic. I genetically like. I love it. Like we have great skin. I'm not gonna go bald. We don't have shoulder hair. Like if I if I like rap music, it's not weird. Like you know, <laughs> it's great. Genetically, it's great. We don't face a lot of opposition either. Like I know Trump says some stuff. I don't take what Trump says seriously. My biggest adversity is not like telling people that like I don't rape people. My biggest adversity is convincing people that I don't like pit bull. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Did the dog like that joke? Yeah. Yeah. Crickets love He's all over the place. Oh, the crickets, yeah. I get it. I get it. I have a whole bunch of material. I'm, I'm making sure to specifically do stuff that Noggle hasn't heard. Because uh, this is Fort where is Noggle? Right here. Oh, um, this is great. This is a cool backyard that you have, by the way. You got all like the different sections and stuff. You got the like the Bonnaroo section right here. You got like the Fire Kingdom kind of going on over here. It's nice. I uh, I like it. I I'm in a weird mood. I saw Batman vs Superman the other day. I don't know if you guys have seen it. I feel weird about superhero stuff. I have too many questions about it. Are you guys like a fan of Batman? Do you like him? Yeah. 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 Fuck Batman. Here's the thing. I know. I know. Here's the thing. Is Batman really that great, or or, or do cops in Gotham suck? Has anyone? Th Half of the stuff that this dude goes against are totally shootable. First of all, it, it, so there's like superheroes and supervillains, and then it's like stuff that we don't need Batman for. It's like you don't understand Batman. He has riddles. Like like what am I fucking twelve? Like this isn't a real problem. Do your jobs, cops. Oh, he's, it's got like an umbrella, and it's like a gun. I'm like, yeah, we're used to guns. We're cops. This isn't a real... Catwoman's a thief. It's like, this is what cops do. This is... You can't even get a hold of the dude during the day. All right. I think Spider-Man's over, overrated, too. I'm not a Spider-Man guy. First of all, he's from New York. You. Second of all, Aww. when you think about it... He has to be from New York. That's the thing. He has to be from New York. He's, he has, needs shit to swing off of, which is like his whole thing. Have you thought about... Spider-Man would be garbage in L.A. There's too much of it. There's too much stuff. We see like the first jogging Spider-Man. It'd be like issue one. Like, oh, I got a spider cramp. It's like not the same. There's just not enough Ubers for the dude. It wouldn't even be cool. It wouldn't even be funny to be like, oh, no, spider sense going off. Something's going down in... Pasadena, like, fuck, uh, he's just driving <laughs> on the 405. I'm going to actually, I, I want to wrap it up, because this is great, and I'm warming up and stuff, but I actually, I'm, I'm excited about the act, and I want to get drunk, too, because I didn't drive, and some of you did. Uh, my favorite part about drinking and driving, I think, uh, for me, uh, texting. <laughs> Adrenaline rush. <laughs> it's funny. Uh, April Fool's is a weird holiday, though. It's like the one holiday where the tradition, like you know, there's like like Christmas is about giving, like Thanksgiving is about like sharing and stuff. April Fool's is it's just about it's just about lying to your friends. It's just just lie to the ones you love 
and made, I like that you don't even need a card for April Fools. Either you don't even, you don't have to do anything. Like a card on April Fools is like divorce papers. <laughs> it's just like I got you. You're like thank you. Like it's not. It's just a joke. It's like a sonogram from the chick you met four months ago. <laughs> it's like hey, April Fools. <laughs> The worst day to be pregnant, probably, April Fool's. Or just, like, find out you're pregnant, because no one will give a shit about you. It's like, nice try. Like, no, this is the life. Like, shut up. You're a hat. <laughs> I like Valentine's Day. I like it. I think it's really romantic to be original, too. Um, and I think a cool tip, I'll give you guys a tip. I think most people are doing Valentine's Day all wrong. They're doing it all wrong. Like, my advice, don't go out on Valentine's Day. Don't go out on Valentine's Day. Everyone goes out on Valentine's Day. It's crowded. You have to make reservations. It's just a hassle. My tip, go out the day before Valentine's Day. The day before. Make it yours. It's not going to be as like, crazy and stuff. It'll be like more personal. And that way, when Valentine's Day comes around, you can spend it with your wife. I just realized how married a lot of you are. <laughs> and I get that. I get that. No, stay together. It's not that funny of a joke. I do like that you didn't like the fact that I was that I might have planted the seed or something. I don't know. <laughs> Whatever. Um, recently, about four months ago, recently my my grandma passed away, and, and it happens. It's it's very sad. The problem is when it happens, your friends they always try to console you, right? They try to like like give you advice. And sometimes it, it doesn't help at all. I was telling my buddy about it. I was like, yeah, you know, my, uh, my grandma just passed away. And he was like, hey, man, you know, my great grandma just passed away. So, like, I feel you, man. And I remember just, just being like, like, that's, that's not the same thing. That is not, that's not, the, first of all, that's the practice grandma. I think we can all agree. And people get really weird about that. They get really offended, like, especially Spanish. Like, hey, my great grandma's 28, you know. I'm like, what do you say to that? <laughs> I'm sure a lot of your great grandmas died. She wasn't that great. None of you knew her. None of, okay. Your great grandma was that. No, never mind. She was a bitch. I'll say it. Maybe a Nazi. I don't know the lineage. <laughs> All right. This is great. I want to let's let's liven this up with some music. Because I'm about to start leaning on like like older stuff, and I don't want to. Because this is fun. And at fact, thanks for having me up. Where'd you go, Noggle? Where are you? Oh, okay. Thank you. This is great. You guys are great. This backyard's awesome. It's very nice. It's very sexy. The fire and stuff, right? Sexy. Yeah. You got a dog. Some yeah. people like that. Are into that. Ow. <laughs> I'll end with a stupid joke. This is it, it's dumb, but like people. When you're a comic, people always come up to you like, I like that one joke, and it's never the best joke. It's always just like the simplest one. Um, I'll just say it. <laughs> I, don't, I don't ride the bus anymore. All right? I don't ride the bus anymore because the bus has an attitude. Yeah, like, sure, it's cool when you're on the bus. When you get off the bus, the bus is like, psh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm done. Thank you. That was fun. Thank you. So, you guys excited? Yeah. What's about to happen? Yeah. 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 I'm excited. I, I I had second thoughts about doing this because I was like, well, let's just I just want to see the, the show because it's gonna be great, guys. I'm really excited. I haven't seen them before, but the reputation precedes them because all my friends have. I keep hearing great things. Where are you, Lola? Yeah, I, I hear fantastic Woo. stuff. So don't fuck it up. <laughs> and if you do, just say April Fools and you can get away with it. It's like one day you just be like, hey, mess that note up. April. Mm. Okay. Um, guys, please, start putting your hands together. Start yeah. making some noise for the fantastic Lola and the Dusty Roads, everybody. Do I need to adjust this? Are you good? Thank you. Uh, can we get a round of applause for Matthew? Yeah. Yeah. Hey there, honey, I'm busy. I'm busy, but I'll be right there. Hi guys. Oh, I am echoey. It is very echoey up here. Uh, hi friends. Huh? Oh, I guess we're tuning. Hello. 
Um, my name is uh, Lil Rhodes, and I'm with the Dusty Rhodes, apparently. Killer honey, take a seat, buddy. Take a seat. Oh! <laughs> 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 Yet. Yet. I feel like there's a seance happening, and that's probably not a good sign. There's another one there, too. Watch out. Yeah, I probably should have. Yeah, you know what? I wanted to say that there are, like, I probably um, should have, like, moved There's, like, one behind there. There's some questionable ones that, you know, no one would know about. You'll be all right. There. That's what, that's what I figured he would do all night, is go on the pillow. Um, hi, guys. Thanks for coming out, and thank you, Ryan and Amanda, for hosting us. Uh, I want to really quick, I'm going to obviously shout out to her at the end of this as well, but this, everything you see here is by the eternal child, Valerie Noel. So we need to, where is she? There she is. She's amazing. Absolutely amazing. Um, so this is brought to you by her. We're going to start with a song called Oh No. And uh, completely appropriate, I feel like. I had to ask Dick for the first line, and he knew it. Thank you, Dick. Wait, oh, also, there's obviously a 70s vibe going on here, but this is like, <laughs> he's killing it. Yeah. Crushed it. Just, just everyone. This is called Oh No. That's a real mustache. <laughs> I will give him that. <laughs> yeah? Take the fun out of the game You never fail to pay the blame But if you open up your eyes The beauty of the game was what made you and I so oh, The beauty of the game was 
every month. So there actually are some Facebook, Periscope, new fans here. So I just want to say hi to you guys and thanks for coming out. Um, and that's what's happening. Uh, my boyfriend Ran, thank you so much for manning the technology station because I don't have time. <laughs> Shout out to Tobias Fox for purchasing a shout out. Uh, who? Tobias Fox. Tobias Fox? Tobias Fox, here is your shout out. Tobias? Tobias. Tobias. He's a Bias Fox. So excited. What happened? I didn't see anything happen. What do you, what's the problem? I know. There's some kind of mad squirrel here. A candle, and now the light. No, 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 no. I think it's the violin. All the lamps are going to break. That duke's going to catch on fire. No, they're they're Christmas lights. It's ambiance. It's very ambiance. It's artsy. Yeah, we're going for something that was actually timed. So thank you, Eternal Child. I'm just kidding. It was my fault. She's like, it was not my plan. Um, well, the lights are drifting down and... Uh, oh, oh, funny segue. Oh. <coughs> um, funny you mentioned that, uh, Moses. The next song is actually called Drifting. No, really? Yes, yeah, it is. And it was planned. Um, <laughs> oh! Oh, gosh. Oh, really drifting. Oh, 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 <laughs> we should go right now. <laughs> okay, everyone, go now, now. <laughs> You know, it's funny because I had a feeling it would, I mean, I don't mind starting, let's do it. I had a feeling this would happen, but that's, that's the beauty of, you know, it's tape. I guess the, the air is moist, and so it's, I don't know, I'm trying to be a scientist here. Huh? Oh, they need a moment. So, woo! <laughs> 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 I like to collect words together and, and, and say things. Um, but anyway, I feel like I didn't finish my thought. So I'm doing, instead of doing the traditional, I'm going to drop my mic too. Um, not in a good way. Uh, what was I saying? Oh, I really sing a song every month. <laughs> and... Um, also doing, instead of doing the traditional venue route, um, I have really great friends and really great supporters <laughs> who um, want to help um, <laughs> tape stuff. Uh, <laughs> doing just like the streaming kind of takeover. Right now I'm streaming on Periscope, Facebook, and Concert Window. And just doing, you know, house concerts and, and just interesting venues that um, <laughs> just not going the traditional route because as an independent artist, you can do whatever you want. So I'm trying yeah. to do that. You, most of you know what I'm talking about. So just get it done. And then, huh? Oh, this is echoey. Um, cheers. <laughs> do we, uh, do we want to do the song? Because I feel like I'm not eye level anymore. Oh, Dick's helping. We need Dick. Do you want to do it? Do <laughs> you want to do it? Um, so yeah, drifting is very appropriate for this moment. So we're going to continue with it. This, um, I released a bunch of music under my real name, Lana Marie. I mean, I'm just, I'm not, I'm going into it. I t then, see, when I, when I choose to talk or when I, you know, find some words to use, then I talk too long. So now we're here. Now we're here. We're way too long chatting. Um, like, even on the stream, people are like, could you shut up and just sing? I'm like, oh, totally. Yeah, that's, that's fine. Well, I'm not. They actually sing. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, you're starting. Like the way you run your mouth 
her brain. But all you seem to talk about <laughs> is what can make it easier on my heart so I can please you. I can't stand to fill you up with doubt. Stuck is just a poor excuse. The victim has a story too, but that's not me. And that's not you. And they chipped in like planets with no access to the sun. There's no signs of changing, and the worst is to speak up. And how? Every day seems like a taste Will I figure my way out from the race? If I wait till I get older Will you hold me on your shoulders? Show me life with you is the best And we're drifting like planets With no access to the sun There's no signs of changing And the worst is just begun It's just a poor excuse The victim has a story too If I promise to be wiser With these words I exercise I know there's something Up that we call Fix Whitney. Fix Whitney. Uh, it was appropriate at the time, and now it is no longer appropriate to call it that. But <laughs> I didn't do it. <laughs> it's called Fix Whitney. <clears throat>
But if you never try, then you'll never know. new music every month and this was the first release it's called Marina Del Rey Woo! Yeah! Yeah. it's on Woo! iTunes and I really like it so I hope you do Woo! <clears throat> um, yeah. yeah it's a love song it'll be a love song once it's in tune yeah be like in tune love songs oh there you go I'm just uh, moistening the cords. Uh, <coughs> I get it. Ow! <laughs> Moist. Anyone feel uncomfortable? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you don't. <laughs> this guy. <laughs> <laughs> I saw him just like me. I don't know how to work. Moist. Moist. Okay. <clears throat> Marina Del Rey. I'm going to start. Who? <laughs> <laughs>
is just a night but it's a song that keeps me holding on to you know and I know that I may have said too much you don't believe in such but you Every time I look away, you find me. We've the most peculiar timing, and I always choose to stay. Time goes, but it doesn't matter to me. Give me
you. How's Killer doing? Is he okay there? I usually put him to sleep when I sing. Hopefully that's not the overall vibe. <laughs> The birds are waking up. <laughs> oh. It's time to wake up. <laughs> um, okay, so we'll do that. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. That's enough that. <clears throat> um, okay, so this is, this is technically why we're all here tonight, um, is this yeah. next song. Woo! Woo! So with every monthly release, I'm not good at explaining anything. So with every monthly release, there's a monthly pop-up concert. Um, and so this is the song of March slash April. Yeah. But it's, there'll be a new song in April. But this is called um, I Want to Be. And I I, um, I really like this song because it's, it's not about, um, you know, the typical love relationship thing. It's kind of a song that I need. I didn't realize I needed it at the time that I wrote it, but um, it rings very true to me on a daily basis. So it's kind of one of those like, oh, fuck, that's what I've been feeling. Oh, my God, I have been listening like shit. Um, so this is called I Want to Be. <laughs> Yes, I just blew bubbles into my drink. It's <laughs> <laughs> not in tune. Yeah. We're gonna go with it. We're gonna go with it. It'll be fine, right? Should I do it? Maybe like YOLO. Don't untune to the beach. <laughs> He's like, I gotta untune. I gotta untune. Should I tune it? I think so. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> oh my god, what is this? I'm gonna play I wanna be. Woo! There it is. We're like in the middle of something, but it's cool. It's really cool. It's like middle of a concert, but uh It'll be fine. That's I got, right. I got it for Snapchat. Oh! <laughs> I just gotta put a filter on it. <laughs> uh, you guys go ahead. Oh, we should start? Okay. <laughs> I wanna be free, wanna fly, wanna fly, wanna fly on my own. I wanna set fire to this life, find a dream, find a dream of my own. Wipe my eyes dry, it's time to go. There's more to this life that I know. If I leave on a whim, on a whim in the middle of night. Just go with my gut, let the moon and the stars guide me. Will it come like a shock, like a shock, like a shock to the heart? Or will it creep from behind, from behind, and slowly start to start to ignite? Don't want to be tied to the truth or the lies that follow me home. They pile and pile on top of me. I'm in a choke. Hold. If I stay, if I stay, if I stay, then I'll never know. 
how to love, how to love, how to love, cause I'll never let go of, of the unknown. I don't want to be afraid of falling, cause I know it, cause I know we have to fall. And I don't never listened to my heart. I never had a fresh start. Maybe there's something that I gotta learn that cannot be taught. Or maybe I'm chasing a dream that's already been caught. Keep tomorrow at bay. I wanna live. I want to believe in me somehow. I want to be free. I want to fly. I want to fly. I want to fly on my own. I want to set fire to this life. Find a dream. Find a dream of my own. Wipe my eyes dry. It's time to go. There's more to this life that I know. And I don't want to end my days forever with the thought I never listened to my heart. I never had a faith. I want to be free, want to fly, want to fly, want to fly on my own. I want to set fire to this life, find a dream, find a dream of my own. Wipe my eyes dry, it's time to go. There's more to this life that I, that I know. And I just have to say, thank you guys. I just have to say, um, uh, bringing back up the eternal child, Valerie Noel, um, for Marina Del Rey and for I Want to Be. She has um, produced two beautiful music videos. Yeah. So if you guys want to connect with me, um, lolaroads.com, pretty much everything is right there. Um, they're so beautiful, and uh, she's so very talented. So thank you, the eternal child. <laughs> Grab a shaker if you don't have one. There's some. Uh, Grab something that just there it is. There's an egg. There's an egg. That's good. That's it. Yeah, eggs. There's an egg. Anybody want a tambourine? Who's on tambo? Who's on tambo? We don't have a tambo. We have. Who's got a tambo? I, I hear jingles over there. That's my keys. The keys. Oh, I'll take it. Um. So this is the drinking song. Woo! Yeah. Right. Like, Ten million bottles of beer on the wall. That's a big countdown. <laughs> Ten million. I don't even know where to go from there. That's a lot of drinks. No, there's one less now. No, there's always, there's always 10 million. Yeah. Well, you passed it around, so I feel like there's one less. But, but somebody tops it off. Well. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> um, so yeah, there's a breakdown in this. Feel free to grab something or bang on your neighbor's head. Whatever. I don't care. Bang your neighbor. Do you? Your neighbor. <laughs> bang your neighbor. That's what this is. Like, where there's blankets. Like, I'm pretty much setting the mood. Actually, the eternal child is setting the mood. <laughs> there she is. I knew she'd show that face. Candles, fire, bang your neighbor. <laughs> this is called Tonight's the Night. Oh my god, there's a weird moth. Please don't go near you. I can't deal with it. I can't deal with it. I swear to god, I'm. <laughs>
Absolutely awesome. The videos? The, videos. the streaming or the music videos? The music videos. Hmm. Hey, thanks, Dan Ketch. <clears throat> Where is he? He's on. Concert window. He's on concert window? Is that what you said? Mm-hmm. Cool. Hey, Dan Ketch. <clears throat> um. Oh, yeah, okay. So this next one is called Completely Screwed. It's a little song. And uh, feel free to bang uh, your neighbor. Um, oh, I get that confused. Uh, bang something. Uh, 
You've taken this oath with yourself before And every time all the rules go out the door I don't wanna stop, don't wanna miss a thing But you're pulling my heart and I think I'm gonna get into you I've got no clue what to do Cause you and I are so completely screwed It's in your hands to go and cut me loose If you think that I'm overreacting and you have a much better way of explaining to me How you fully intend to take care of my life Then maybe Say it again like I said before It's not worth the wait if you're not begging for more Don't know what this is, what will come of this With every kiss there's another thing I, I miss about you I've got no clue what to do Cause you and I are so completely screwed It's in your hands to go and cut me loose if you think that I'm overreacting and you have a much better way of explaining to me how you fully intend to take care of my heart, then maybe you and I won't be completely screwed. Take it away, Dick. play this one time. I don't even know why I'm telling the story. I should just shut up. Anyway, I played this song one time and I realized I realized my age. Mind you, I'm not old and I'm not about to tell you how old I am. I'm not old. 21. 21. Hey guys, I can drink. No. But it was funny. I just, I played this song and I was like, okay, you guys are going to get it. And when I played it, they were like, no, it actually sounds like rape. And I was like, oh, God. Mm, that wasn't my intent. Like, I, I'm so sorry. So, I mean, I feel like well, you, you guys are going to know what song it is. I mean, you, you did title a song 
It's called Sweat Angel, but it's an Angel Sweat, Angel Sweat, whatever. Um, but yeah. even the song is it, it's from it, it's Inner Circle. Does anyone know what Inner Circle is? You'll hear, you'll know the song. You know Red Red Wine. Yeah. Okay. Well, they did another one. What? This one. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> they did another one. You guys are gonna know it. And you're gonna hate that you know it. You're like, oh look, I do know that one. But if I know it, I know no music. And if I know it, someone knows it. But I felt really bad after singing that song. <laughs> so, uh, at the mall. <laughs> at the mall for <laughs> Toys for Tots. <laughs> I did not sing it. Um, ooh, the lava lamps are going. <gasps> Guys, it's been like four hours. And now it looks like that. <laughs> it's amazing. <laughs> Guys, but lava lamps. Like, when's the last time you saw lava lamps? Let's just, like, ask yourself that. Apparently, you have all. Wednesday, it was Wednesday. <laughs> okay, so this is Angel Sweat or Sweat Angel, whatever you guys. Kelly, you alright? It doesn't seem like it. it. Seems like you you need something. Okay. Can we try this? Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Sweat Angel. I'm back on. Ready? <laughs> I got it. I don't start it. We're gonna do one more. <clears throat> Yeah. 
It did sound oh. like racy. <laughs> yeah, I see that. It's kind of racy. It a little bit racy. <laughs> um, I, I didn't write it, but you guys know that song. You've heard that song. And it's like such like a fun, like, oh my god, yeah. It's like, yo, don't do that to people. <laughs> Um, okay, so everyone, <laughs> fuck it. Um, please raise your glass real quick. I'm gonna try to um, compile words together because I'm really good at that. <laughs> Killer, who's coming? It's okay, buddy. Okay, so. Huh? <clears throat> damn it, Killer. It's fine. It's actually you're, you're helping me out. Um, any cute guys? Um, <laughs> So I just wanted to say that, um, as most of you guys know here, uh, being in this industry, this type of industry, um, it takes a lot of time, effort, and money, and um, none of it would really matter if you know you guys weren't here to support. And I just wanted to give a quick shout out to Amanda and Ryan for hosting this. Yeah. Yeah. The Eternal Child, Valerie Noel. Um, you're amazing, and she's helping me out this whole year, and it's just a wonderful thing. And uh, these lovely creatures up here, Moses on guitar, they make it sound so beautiful. Desiree on violin, and uh, Dick. How good does he look, though? Like, are you serious? Like, he, 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 he like upstaged me. Like, it's fine, though. Like, it's just so good. Oh, now he did that. So, like, even the fucking strap. Are you kidding? He bought this today. I, it's amazing. I'm sorry. I gave that away. I'm sorry. I gave that away. But seriously, thank every single one of you for coming out tonight. Yeah. Everyone. It's hard to make eye contact when you've had a shot. Like, like hey, guys. Um, what? Have more. Have more. Have more shots? Okay, fine. No, guys. Um, I hate it. <laughs> but seriously, just thank you and cheers to all of you guys. Um, I'm very excited about this year and about sharing all this music with you. So thank you for supporting. Cheers. Oh, and thank you, honey, for being my number one fan and my number one supporter. So thank you. Cheers. Oh. <coughs> Uh, Goddamn Moss. <laughs> Thanks, Moss, for being an ass. Wait, Lola. Yes. Uh, Micah, Michael, uh, bought a reward of preview of next month's release in case. Michael, you, wanna, you got a review. In case you want to incorporate that a preview. Oh, we didn't <laughs> reverse it, and I don't know it. Um, <laughs> thorough. You guys don't know oh. it, and I don't even know it. <clears throat> um, next month's song is gonna be so cool. Um, <laughs> Thanks, Michael, for purchasing that. But you already heard it. And um, thank you, Periscope, and thank you, Facebook Live, and thank you, Concert Window. I hope you have good angles. Rand's pretty good at angles, I feel like. That was sexual or trigonometry. Trigonometry. Whichever one. Um, so sexy. Um, thanks, guys, for tuning in. I hope Periscope's giving me a lot of hearts. They tend to not give me hearts. Are they giving me hearts? No. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, and thank you, first of all, for the fans that came out tonight from Periscope slash Facebook slash World Life. Amazing. It's so nice to meet you guys. And Josephine, like, are you kidding? I've no. Well, apparently I've known Josephine for like five or six years, and we've actually never met. But uh, she's also a singer-songwriter, so we need to check out her music as well. Um, just so funny. Thank you guys for coming out. I could just say thank you all night. <laughs> thank you. Jim Bob said good angle. Huh? Jim Bob said good angle. Who did? Jim Bob. Jim Bob? Thanks, Jim Bob. It's a good angle, isn't it? Um, it's not the angle on the level. Um, this la uh, last one. Oh, shit, did I do this? <laughs> I mean, this last one is called Don't April, Forget. April Fool. <laughs> no, that comes after. Oh. <clears throat> don't forget, so don't. <laughs> <laughs> See you happy. 
Thanks for tuning in. So many hearts. Bye, neighbor.